Here's your March 2024 Tacoma and surrounding areas market update. Last month, the average home sold in Tacoma for $518,000, and that's down 1.4% in a rolling 12 months. So, so let me explain that a little bit, because when you think about the numbers going down, you say, oh, well, the market might be tanking. No, it's actually not tanking. In fact, it's becoming quite active. We're seeing multiple offers on homes right now. So what's happening is that people have to get what they can afford. And most people's affordability has gone down with the interest rate changes. So we're seeing a lot more homes in the lower price point sell than the upper price point, which brings the average down. I'd love to explain that in more detail. If you have any more questions, just go ahead and comment below or reach out directly. I'm Charity with the Livewell Home Group. And if you're thinking about buying or selling in Tacoma or any other area in Washington, we'd love to help you. We've made it easy for you to connect with this. Just go ahead and text us directly or use the link in the description below to jump on our calendars. In Tacoma, the percentage of list price sold is 99.8%, which is pretty good, right? It's almost 100%. One thing you want to keep in consideration is that sellers right now are tending to pay some closing costs because buyers need them to get into homes. So even though it might not, you might not be netting 100%, it's still pretty close to that 99.8%. The average days on market in Tacoma is about 35. That's pretty good. It's about a month. Now, back in COVID times, it was a lot different. And things were selling in like five days, but 35 days is not that bad at all. In fact, when you look at the history of how long it takes houses to sell, 35 days is right on. Tacoma has 1.2 months of average supply. And what that means is that if nobody sold their home for the next 1.2 months, then it would take that long for all of those homes to be sold. So 1.2 months is really not very high. It's a seller's market still. So let me explain that a little. If we had four to six months of inventory, that would actually be an even market where not the buyer or the seller is in control. So right now it is still drastically a seller's market because we have such low inventory. Last month in Tacoma, 306 homes went on the market and 214 sold. That means there's a little bit of inventory stacking up, but that's a good thing because buyers are desperate looking for houses that they love. There's currently only 279 homes on the market. And I know when I'm working with buyers, we are tending to wait a little bit right now because they are waiting for something that really suits their needs. So if you are a seller and you're thinking, well, I wonder if now is a good time. Now is actually a good time because there are buyers waiting for your home. And in fact, as I mentioned earlier, there are multiple offers starting to happen. The houses that are priced well and are in great condition. And if you'd love to chat more with that, just go ahead and raise your hand in the comments below or reach directly out to us. Let's take a look at Furcrest now because it's to home ish right? It's all part of that same area. 601000 was the average price of homes, and that was down 5.8%. No need to freak out. As I explained earlier, it just means a lot of homes in the lower price points are selling right now. And if we're crest, you're getting an average of 100.1% of list price. So hey, that's great. The average days on market is 35 days, so the same as Tacoma, but they only have Point two months of inventory, which is crazy. There it means there's a lot of people that want to live in Furcrest. So if you're a seller there, it is definitely a good time to sell. So in Furcrest last month, four homes came on the market and four sold, leaving us with only 35 homes on the market. So you can see why there's such a low amount of inventory there. All right, just right next to Furcrest is UP. Let's talk about that. The average price point was 715,000 and it was down 1.2%. Sellers of Furcrest are getting 100.7% of list price, so way to go sellers. That is definitely a hot area. And what also shows what a hot market that one is, is that it's only 25 days on market for an average there, which is 10 days lower than Furcrest and Tacoma. There's only one month of supply there, so there's not much and people are waiting for homes. So if you've got one in UP, as I said with Furcrest and Tacoma, it's a great time to sell. In fact, only 21 people put their home on the market last month and 15 of them sold, leaving only 19. So if somebody is looking for a house in UP, they don't have very many options and they really want to have some more options. So after you've listened to all this, you might be wondering, hmm, maybe it is the right time for me to sell, but I still have some more questions. We would love to answer those questions for you so you can make whatever decision is best for you. Just go ahead and reach out in the comments below or direct message us or jump on our calendars.